What is your philosophy about an actor being SAG eligible? Uh, do you want them to remain eligible, see them go ahead and wait until they're a must join, uh, join the union immediately? What is your general feeling about that kind of in-between SAG status? Me as their agent, I guess I don't really care. I think the only reason why somebody who is SAG eligible, two reasons why someone who's SAG eligible would not join. One is they don't have the money. I get that. Two is because they're making a lot of money doing non-union commercials. I have a couple of clients that are in that position. So for them, they understand if once they join that they're likely to see a drop in their income, which is kind of intuitive than the way guilds are supposed to be working, but they're making more doing non-union films or commercials primarily. There's nothing other than commercials that should matter, really. But if I were an actor I, and I became SAG eligible, I would join as quickly as possible because I just don't, I, I, you came here to be a professional actor, you have to, you have to take the steps of a professional actor. I, I, would, I would try as hard as I could and fast as I could to get that card in my wallet.